love on the text, telling me I'm next up. At the party, crazy, wavy, why we make the next one? Run up on your TV screen, looking clean as fuck. ESPN on the email already, inviting me to the next one. You saw me at the SBs, should've worn my fresh lease. But that's okay, the soccer bitches told me I look sexy. Oh, yeah, Lord, I'm fucking out here. Oh, yeah. Fuck these other guys that feel like, oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah Look at this shit that I'm on, I got these bitches, they callin' my phone Come through my crib and like phone when I'm on We get it on, get off, then go on, I'm on right now And it's us right now That's why I'm lit up the lick in the cup right now In the back of the club with the stars and the sluts in the cup right now Like, wow, goddamn Got goals, got plans, got hoes, got fans God knows I am Doing everything everyone said I can And Twizzy to hit me like we in the city, let's get it I said, show sure enough, now let's go up Cause that's where we headed yeah. I used to care too much Yeah I used to feel too much Yeah, yeah, yeah I used to feel alone So I went out on my own Now I'm out here on the map And ain't nothing wrong with that I ain't never going back I ain't never going back Did everyone have fun? Did everyone have fun? I hope so. I mean, I didn't really see it too busy down there. But if we're going to be honest, did it need to happen on fucking Main Street or, or London? No. No, it didn't. Was the traffic a fucking headache? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely was. Ultimately, was it for a good cause? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Again, did everyone have a good time? I did. Hazel did. Got to see some friends. You know, everyone was enjoying themselves. There were a couple of weird moments. The Carney with the dog trapped in the van. Fucking Carney's asked me to fucking... If they could pitch their tent in my backyard because of the weather. It was good, though. It was good for business. It was good for hammer time, for sure. Uh, Logan and Lindsay Shreve, they did a big part for Hammer Time. Was, that was cool to see. Um, Logan Chandler, her dog Wilson, won second place in the pet contest. I did not enter Hazel in the pet contest. Um, well, a couple of people down there who uh, who I don't get along with. I kept my mouth shut for the peace, for the, the greater good. Was it as busy as it should have been? No, it should have been busier, but, but here's the problem. Number one, I don't know why it's not open today on Sunday. Number two, Grove City's Wine Fest is going on this weekend. So I had a family dinner yesterday I had to go to in Grove City. They had to go. I wanted to go to. Um, uh, when I got to downtown Grove City, it was extremely busy. So I think that had a lot to do with it. Uh, the weather definitely didn't help, but it was also pretty awesome on Friday night when we had that giant light show. I got some really, really awesome live videos on my iPhone. I made some videos out of them. It's pretty neat. Pretty, pretty, pretty neat. So I know the residents on Market Street are glad it's over. Uh, 
stop sign got ripped down once. No one could pay attention to the one-way sign. I did my best to help. Uh, I tried. I actually went out and got a couple of sheets of plywood and then wrote some messages on them trying to direct semis away from downtown Mount Sterling, but it did not did not pan out. Kyle and I drove all the way around and we couldn't find a route for the semis to get through unless you go all the way down to Midway or some shit like that. I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. Uh, Brantley. Well, I don't know if Brantley and Brayden were both in the dunk tank or just Brayden. Well, Brayden wants to be in the news so next week we're going to have some guest stars. Including, but not limited to, Logan Chandler, Anthony Morris, Braden Longcoy. Uh, be cool to see. Maybe we start splitting this all up. So, unfortunately for Logan, she don't wake up till fucking 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So, she can't do the fucking weather. Talking about, I'm the weather girl. And then looking all witchcraft, nodding her head, and a lightning strikes behind her. Get the fuck out of here, that shit. We know you're a witch. Quit playing with us. Come on, man. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Uh. Here's Tom with the weather. It's 70 degrees right now. Fucking feels like 70 degrees right now. Uh, high of 89 or 90 today. Gonna be a hot one. Um, going fucking kayaking from Trapper John today. So jump in the river if you got it. Smoke if you got them. It's gonna rain tomorrow on Monday. Welcome to Oven News, Michael Starr. Happy Sunday. Okay. Uh, fucking watch, man. Fucking updated this morning. 6.44 a.m. It is 70 degrees outside right now. Right now. In local news. We have started a walking group. Uh, I think it's going to take place at different locations. I'm just trying to promote some health for Mount Sterling. I think it would be great. We've got 17 members or something, maybe 12. Uh, Courtney James, she's in the medical field. I believe she's a nurse. Kelly Crossland, also in the medical field. She is a nurse. Uh, they're going to be the admins for this group. This is another group that I've created. <coughs> I've been working out a lot lately, trying to get in shape, trying to be more healthy. I recently found out my little brother has diabetes, so I'm trying to avoid that happening to me. But uh, different locations, people can you can jog, you can walk, or just all meet at a central location around the same time and promote health and, and lift each other up. It's a great idea to get involved. The group is called Fuck It, comma, Let's walk there. Go join it. It's a public group. I'm not making this one private. In other news, Oven has 912 members. I'd like to see that at 1,000 members before the end of next week. So before the next broadcast, I want to see it. Whoever invites the most people will get a free Oven t-shirt. Uh, local businesses still looking for storefronts. If you know anybody who has an empty space that's renting it out for cheap, I've got several ideas that I want to accomplish. One being a local gym. Two being a Star Signature storefront. I'd like to see this happen. London, uh, I know the zoning, new zoning plan came out. We don't have the new map down at City Hall yet. Uh, I'll get that as soon as, as soon as I have it. So we need a petition to make Logan the new weather girl. I don't think she wants to do it. We gotta come together as a community and make her do it. <laughs> okay, 
so let's look at the schedule. I know that the Food and Flea on July 4th has been canceled. Uh, there's too many people saying that they can't do it. It was part of the city, their town hall meeting last Monday. And I know that they canceled these protein farts, man. I'm telling you, they don't even smell bad. They're just weird and tight. The next Food and Flea is going to be at Mason Park on August 1st. We still have not set a date for the movie night. Uh, July 2nd. Friday, July 2nd is the judging for the beautiful yards. I did nominate 206 on New Street. Uh, I think I'm going to nominate Kyle too. Kyle, he's put some time into his yard, like a retiree time. You should see his face though. I complimented on how his flowers flow out of his bed. He was, he was like, dum, dum, bit, dum, dum. <laughs> June 26th is a car show at Dairy Freeze. And I know that Automedics is getting Mopar involved, so I will not be there. I'm kidding. Automedics is a great place. Very honest people. Love Bambi and Tony to death. Great, great, great people. Uh, very honest. Very good at what they do. And, and Tony is doing body repair and painting now. So full one-stop shop. Performance, repair, maintenance, body modification. <laughs> That's all I got. Don't stop complaining. It's entertaining. See you next week.